everybody and welcome back to another class in your twist and turn series. We're going to begin at the top of our mat, bringing the feet hip width distance apart, hands go up and above head before exhaling as we swan dive over the legs. Inhale, halfway lift, exhale all the way back down to those legs, maybe even bending. We'll run through that two more times, inhaling, halfway lift. Exhaling, forward fold. The last time, inhale, halfway lift. And we'll engage that core, lift up the hands, bringing them into prayer. Then we'll twist using just the waist, the side body, to look over to the right, holding there. Inhale, back to center. Let's go through those halfway lifts. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Last time here, inhaling, lifting up those hands, engaging the core. Hands go to prayer. Twisting, using just the body, the side body, to look over to the left, holding here. back to center halfway lift let's move through a chaturanga vinyasa here knees chest chin or full vinyasa upward dog meeting me and downward dog staying here five breaths really allowing the chest to sink in between the arms breath here, inhaling, looking at the top of the mat, exhaling as you jump, step, hop up to the front, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, roll yourselves on up. Let's do that two more times here, inhaling, bringing the feet a little bit wider this time, exhaling, forward fold, going through those halfway lifts, inhaling, halfway lift, exhaling over the legs, Two more times here. Last time, we're going to take the left hand over to the right foot, grabbing the ankle, and then we'll bring that right foot, or excuse me, right hand over to the left foot. Twisting here gently, breathing deeply, holding here a few breaths. Exhaling, unraveling yourselves, coming on up to a flat back and then falling over the legs. Halfway lift, exhale down. Let's do that two more times before repeating this on the left side. This time right hand goes to left ankle. Left hand goes to the right foot, again gentle twist but deep breathing as we really try to open and lengthen. Last breath here, then we'll unwind ourselves. Inhaling, halfway lift. Exhale, maybe heel toeing the feet in before eating me in plank and moving through that vinyasa. We'll hold and downward five breaths. to play around with some hops or floats on over to the top of the mat looking forward bending the knees jumping exhaling forward fold inhale halfway lift and then we'll roll ourselves on up last time we're really gonna spread the feet right to the outside of the mat inhaling arms go up 
Exhaling as we swan dive down the middle. You know the drill. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Doing that two more times. The last time. Let's go ahead, drop that left hand in the middle. Right hand goes up, keeping the hips as squared as possible. Really just trying to twist from the waist. A last breath. And then we'll exhale as we bring the right hand to meet the left. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale down. Two more times here, inhaling, halfway lift, exhaling down. Last time here, bringing the right hand in the middle, really twisting from that side body, extending the left hand, again, squaring off those hips as much as possible, staying here a few breaths. yourself coming to a halfway lift then jumping on back or stepping on back to plank moving through that vinyasa let's hold downward dog here the front of the mat and then exhaling over the legs inhaling halfway lift rolling yourselves on up and then rolling yourselves on down coming to seated let's finish off by rolling the shoulders back and forth rolling to one side and the other then raising the hands a left hand goes to right knee gentle twist here just a few breaths last breath here and we'll walk the right hand out to the side the left hand really extends trying to extend past the right hand here feeling that side body stretch staying here a few deep yummy breaths as well heart willing those hands back up to the center we'll do the same on the other side right hand to left knee gentle twist bringing that left hand out now right hand now walks trying to walk past the left hand again really turning towards the sky turning the side body towards the sky really feeling a core heat stretch along that side body breathing deeply here hands back up to center and then bringing them on down to your knees let's shake that out again rolling from side to side and then coming to the tabletop preparing for puppy pose let's come on down to our forearms really allowing the chest to just fall and then we'll extend our hands forward our arms forward forehead to the mat or a block staying here about a minute or so. Option to advance 
advance the posture by bringing the chin to the mat. Staying here another few breaths. Tucking the toes and sliding your way on back and up, we'll find our way to our backs. Both knees into the chest, we'll extend the left leg long, setting up for our supine twist here, inhaling, exhaling, left knee goes, or right knee goes to the left side, gaze goes to the right, right hand extends. Stay here a few breaths before switching. Bring both knees back to the chest, setting up for the left side now. Right leg extends long, bringing that left knee into the chest a little bit more. And then we'll exhale over to the right, gaze goes over to the left. Option to extend the arm, cactus the arm, whatever feels good to your body. center bringing those knees back into the chest one last big hug and then we'll extend those legs long arms long palms facing up for receiving down for grounding let's finish off with the shavasana <music> yourself on up and come to seated. I hope your sides are feeling nice and wrung out. Thank you guys so much for following with me. Namaste and I'll see you soon.